The current population of the Lago Vista is somewhere around 7,200 people. Lago Vista currently uses about 300 million gallons of water per year. Before we started the pressure plane interconnect and the tank mixing program, we were only selling about 50% of the water that we were buying. We were flushing about 2.3 million gallons a year out of our three primary tanks up to seven times a year. Since we've installed the tank mixing and flash bar system, we've never flushed a tank. The tank mixer system was designed to eliminate dead zones in the ground storage tanks and ensure thorough mixing of the water within the tank. The HDPE inlet pipe is designed to go two-thirds up the height of the tank in the center of the tank so that the incoming water is released at the top of the tank in the old the water on the bottom of the tank is what's sent out to the distribution system. The splash pump system was designed to remove trihalomethanes, which are a gaseous byproduct of the chlorination of the organics in the raw water. And the splash bar that the pump is hooked to releases the water above the water level in the ground storage tank, and the impact of the water droplets on the surface of the water dissipate the trihalomethane gas. We have 12 tanks throughout the city. Um, probably about nine of those have the spray bars. The current maximum contaminant level MCL for trihalomethanes is 80 parts per billion. When we started the program, our furthest out tanks sometimes reached 175. We are using HDPE for our water system. We converted over from conventional legacy pipe nine years ago. We've got about 130 miles of HDPE water lines. HDEP pipe is fused together and is a monolithic pipe from valve to valve. It has no bells or spigots and therefore is leak free. Another thing we found out about using HDPE pipe is that it's much easier to install and it's also safer. 